This is an introduction to molecular chaperones. After a protein has been synthesized from the ribosome, the protein begins to fold with the help of some hydrophobic and hydrophilic interactions. Sometimes, however, the protein is not able to fold correctly using these interactions. In this protein in front of you, the yellow clasps represent the hydrophobic side chains, and the white clasps represent the hydrophilic side chains. Currently, there are interactions happening between hydrophobic and hydrophilic parts. This is not correct and does not allow the protein to function. Since the protein needs to function properly for biological processes, its structure must also be correct. In order to fix these misfolded proteins, chaperones, which are also called heat shock proteins, are used to fold protein correctly. The protein recognizes the receptors on the chaperone and enters it. A cap is then placed on top of the heat shock protein to trap the misfolded protein. Then, via cycles of ATP hydrolysis, the protein is folded into its correct shape. Once the process is complete, the cap is removed, the protein leaves the chaperone, and it can go on to complete its goals in the biological processes of life.